We have a great new update coming to one of the most used tools on SiteChecker. In this video we will cover all the main new elements of Rank Tracker 2.0. And starting with the first one, the new design. We made Rank Tracker more informative and useful, while keeping it clean and easy to understand compared to the previous version. Here is a direct comparison between the Rank Tracker and the 2.0 version. Next up, we have an option that allows you to sort keywords by the amount of position change. In the previous version you could see the delta per day, but you could not sort keywords by it. Now this metric is displayed in a separate column and is available for sorting. We also added filtering keywords by multiple conditions. In the previous version you could only sort keywords by one parameter at a time. Now you can set several filters conditions at once. Another addition is preset filters for your calendar. The most popular date ranges are now available for selection in one click. Let me show you how it works. Another helpful feature we added is leaving comments below the graph about important changes. You can leave important notes for yourself or your clients, executives or any team in general. You can add notes about content changes, Google updates, new links, any changes that might affect your page rankings. For now, this needs to be done manually, but we will gradually automate this process and the important events that we found in other instruments will be added on the chart. Now you can hide the graph and expand the spreadsheet to full screen to cover more data. This way you can cover more keywords at a glance. Especially true for owners of devices with low resolution. If you hide the graph, we will save your preferences and every time you will be taken directly to the table with the ranking data. Next up, we have exploring the dynamics of positions in a pivot table. In the previous version, to see ranking for more than 7 days, it was necessary to use pagination and browse through positions in small portions. The pivot table will now have as many dates as you selected in the calendar. Using the horizontal scroll, you can easily access the dynamics of positions over a long period. Conditional formatting of cells remains the same as in previous version. The more the position went up or down, the brighter the cell color will be. Another helpful feature is customizing the table for yourself in advanced block. In addition to the fact that new metrics have appeared in the advanced table, you can customize it for yourself. Use the columns button to display swap freeze columns in this table. Note that the default keyword sorting in the tables is different. In the basic table, all keywords are sorted by volume. In the advanced table, all keywords are sorted by potential rank. Also in advanced block, you can compare positions for any selected dates. Now you can compare how the positions have changed for any two dates for which you have the data in the calendar using the Compare to Dates column. It is so convenient to research how the positions have changed after the last search update or the introduction of a large-scale changes on the site. We also provide a feature to learn which keywords are ranking with the wrong URL than you've originally planned. The function is only available in the advanced table. The link icons next to keywords have three statuses. Yellow icon – target URL was not set. Red icon – target URL is set but does not match the real URL. Blue icon – the target URL is set and matches the real URL. And the last one – we now provide an option to conduct bulk keywords actions. 
Now it's convenient to delete and copy keywords, assign them to a target URL or a group. This helps to organize the keywords more conveniently and will have positive impact on your workflow. This version is just the beginning of the new Rank Tracker. We plan on gradually adding new features down the line. Now the second version of Rank Tracker is available as an additional tool via the link in the sidebar on the left, along with the previous version. But the second version will become the main one eventually.